And now to the story of the Buffalo police officer who spent more than three months in a hospital battling COVID-19. He was finally discharged from ECMC today. Dave McKinley was there for that emotional moment. Cheers went up among assembled friends, family, fellow police officers, and the hospital staff who cared for him. A 38-year veteran of the BPD, Officer Juan Phillips, took ill in mid-March and within two days after being hospitalized was placed on a ventilator on which he remained for the next 31 days. Following another two months of hospital recovery, he emerged on what was a sun-splashed and spectacular day, a great day, just to be outside again. It's been a, about a 101 days that I've been inside. Uh, so being outside for me is out, and just, I'm overwhelmed with the amount of love and the support that everybody has shown me. And it feels good to be, I came here in March, so it feels good in July to be standing here. And he was thankful for that. He was thankful for everything. One of the things I've, in my time here, is realizing uh, the love. The love for all those that I knew and did not know, that shared the prayer, that took a moment. And I want to thank those, the citizens, rather um, locally and those that was out of state, that took a moment to offer a prayer for me. Those that took a moment to send a card, those that took a moment to text me. I just want to let them know I thank them, my family thank them from the bottom of my heart. That type of love and support is what got me through this 100 plus days here at the hospital. Tonight at five, Officer Phillips talks more about his harrowing experience with COVID-19 and the long-term effects he may have to deal with. Dave McKinley, Channel 2 News.